Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. I'm John Swicky, and I thought today we'd do something a little bit different because we spent a lot of time talking about ChatGPT, Google's Bard, and so I thought we'd take a look at kind of that other 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 model in the race. One of one of the other one other more popular models, and this is Claude by Anthropic. So Claude by the Claude model is, is interesting. I've been playing around a little bit. It's not bad. You know, it's available in a couple spots and, you know, we'll kind of dive in and maybe take a look at some, some features and maybe get into some demos and see where we could take it from here. So this is, this is just kind of the product landing page, right? So we'll figure we take a quick look at this. So it's a safer. With constitutional AI built in, cloud is designed to reduce for brand risk, best-in-class data retention, and no training on your data. Okay, pretty cool. Leading the industry with a 100K token window, Claude can handle complex multi-step instructions over a large amount of context. So they do have a 100K token, which is pretty, pretty nuts. And you can personalize. Okay, so partners. All right, so let's look at the models. So there's two, two main models. There's Claude and then Claude Instant. So Claude is, it says the most pop, powerful model and it can, it's good with creative, creative gen, content generation and detailed to detailed instruction. It says good for complex reasoning, creativity, thoughtful dialogue, coding, and detailed content creation. So maybe it looks like this one's more of like the GPT-4 if we wanted to compare. Claude Instant, faster, cheaper. It's still very capable. It can handle a wide variety of tasks. Okay. So low cost, reduced latency, lightweight dialogue, moderation and classification. So this is probably there three and a half, if you would. Let's see pricing. Let's see what we got. Okay, so you can actually use the thousand hundred thousand tokens on either one. So that's actually that's kind of cool. Description's pretty normal and Prices range from a dollar per million tokens to eleven dollars per million tokens. That is, I don't have the Open AI's pricing up in front of me, but that seems seems a little bit more on the higher side. So, well, let's see what language is going. On. Okay, so English. Can the cloud access the internet now? And what does HHS mean? Helpful, honest, and harmless are three components of building AI systems like cloud designed to align people's interests. Well, that seems like a good model. Helpful, cloud wants to help the user. Honest, cloud shares information it believes to be true and avoids making up information. Okay, I mean, if it doesn't, if it has a way to lower hallucinations, that's something to pay attention to. And cloud will not cooperate in any in harmful activity. So there's, there's got to be some sort of behavior layer on top of this. So, all right, let's, let's, let's let me get into some stuff here. So let's see. Let's get a fresh, fresh window open here. All right, let's do, yeah, let's start with Claude Instant. And so now I'm in Poe.com. So Poe is probably the easiest way to test all these models out if you... Yeah, want to want to play around? Want to get into some stuff? All right, let's see. We've got some actually. We've got some some helpful tips here. So let's see. Ten fascinating dinosaur facts for a four year old kid. All right, that was nice and quick. I do like when Pub gives you these follow up questions and stuff. All right, we're going to ask a financial question. So obviously this is just, just is just for demo purposes. Please don't use this as real advice. Can you give me some ETFs that have Apple inside? Okay, so it's just giving me a list of some ETFs that have Apple inside of it. So it's pretty cool. Uh, and I can kind of keep, keep prompting it with some stuff. So... Again, we're not asking anything too, too complex. All right, that's pretty cool. So let's go over to Claude Plus. Clear out the conversation here. All right. 
let's get a, let's get a complex question going. It's I think in past videos I stuck with vegan meals, so let's, let's go for that. Can you make us a vegan meal plan for two people and keep the budget? It's possible. Say we need at least a snack in there as well as one meal be protein and okay so it's making us a little meal plan here now we're using the quad we switched over to quad plus okay what was my problem with meal plan i did say meal plan it only gave me one one day i was hoping for more these suggestions are pretty good gave me kind of a i don't know where i got that dollar amount but pretty good suggestions thankful for poe's fun follow-ups here all right so it's just giving me some more recipes all right so let's see so claude actually has a slack integration so i have a dummy slack account that i installed the claude app so let's see if it's a little bit different than using it on poe this is a kind of an official an official one of the official slack app let's see i need help scheduling some meeting this week i need to keep everything before lunchtime and I need to schedule two team meetings. Can you help with an agenda? So let's see if we can. Oh, okay. I got to opt into something. Sure. Okay. So Claude cannot set timers or reminders and it does not know the current time. All right, so let's give me, so I give it no context, but here's this, uh, here's a proposed meeting agenda for two team meetings this week before lunch. Okay, five minutes greetings, review action items from the last meeting, project updates, discussion, any roadblocks or issues the teams are facing, wrap up and next steps. And the next one, same thing. Team member spotlights. Okay, cool. Highlight the work accomplished of specific team members, discussion of upcoming priorities, projects, action items. Yeah, it's not that bad. It's not that bad. Can you write me an email to my boss saying that I need a sick day tomorrow? And so, see how good it is writing emails. Okay, this is thinking really hard. I feel like that wasn't a that wasn't a complex question. Why is this taking so long? All right, we're gonna go for some one more thing. Let's go for one more thing. Can you help me write out quarter one plan for the team and CEO project? Again, I'm being really vague, but I do like to see sometimes when you when you ask kind of vague questions, what happens? We might have we might have broken the Slack app with the last question. All right, let's move on to the last thing. So. I, so I actually, I got a post subscription to try to play with the hundred K, which is 75,000 words kind of context window. Cause it enables analysis of oh, the lights just went off in the room. Okay. <laughs> so, and you can do very long documents and code. And so I did do some, I did do some demos with it. I tried to give it some a big piece of code to refactor and it uh it kind of kind of did it. it gave me some helpful tips but and then i will say it was a little disappointing on some of the code aspects of it it uh did it did do some creative writing stuff pretty well so let's see if we can prompt you write me a story about a kid named dan loves do SEO work and loves to hike. Hike and come up with an end. Adventure story that works both. Us. 
both of those things together and let's include cat named Mickey. Let's, we're not going to go for 75,000 words because that's crazy, but can you make this 5,000, 5,000 words? Okay. Okay, so immediately it, it can only do a 3,755 word story about Dan. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay, so first off, I'm, I'm surprised that it, it was able to write 4,000 words, almost 4,000 words. Uh, I don't know, maybe I'll post this somewhere, but I love that one of the first follow-up questions from Poe is, can you suggest some SEO techniques that Dan used to rank his blog? And did Dan ever encounter any dangerous animals while hiking with Mickey? I thought that was awesome. So, you know, I think, you know, I, 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 you know, I think Claude, I definitely probably haven't seen anything enough to use Claude for code, but definitely some of the more creative stuff, it, 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 it definitely caught my attention. As you can see here, this is pretty good. Sure, some of the other models can can probably do some of that stuff, but I think that's what's so that's what's so tough. I think right now everybody kind of does some things really really well, and that's why I kind of like Poe.com can kind of hop in between a bunch of these things and try out different things. But so Claude, it you know it, it's definitely something to keep an eye on. They're still getting lots of you know funding, lots of pushing. I definitely want to explore the big the 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 hundred k window a little bit more to see what what kind of interesting things we can do. We could probably summarize big documents really really well. I just don't have a way to like upload a file or anything to it yet. But uh, but yeah, so, quick little overview on Claude and some and some some good examples. And if I do post the story, I'll make sure we link it below. But thanks everyone for taking the journey with me today. I appreciate it, and we'll see you next time.